Hello, everyone. I'm Zhang Fan, a Huawei engineer. Today, I'm going to introduce the network change simulation function of Level Three autonomous driving on Huawei data center networks. Data center networks carrying a growing number of services, which change at increasingly rapid pace. As such, network engineers need to perform multiple emergency drills during routine maintenance. In the traditional mode. They need to analyze the impact and feasibility of the network change solution, set up a mirroring environment, and verify the network change solution. Despite best efforts, services may still be affected by service changes due to complex data center network configurations. This is where the network change simulation function of Huawei iMaster NC Fabric comes in. Powered by Level Three Autonomous Driving, Huawei iMaster NC Fabric uses the formal verification technology and what a verification environment, significantly simulating the impacts caused by network changes. The network change simulation function involves three steps: intent input, underlay network simulation and verification, and overlay service verification. The first step is intent input. In this step. You only need to enter the current network environment and the network change to be performed. The intent engine then converts the network change intent into the corresponding configuration. iMaster NC Fabric then builds a one-to-one -one simulated network environment of the production environment, and performs E2E simulation and verification on the network change intent in the simulated network environment. The second step is underlay network simulation and verification. In this step, iMaster NC Fabric analyzes the impact of changes on the network from multiple dimensions, such as network connectivity, root black hole, address conflict, and configuration consistency. The last step is overlay service verification. In this step, iMaster NC Fabric simulates service connectivity based on the modified network configuration to determine whether the change meets expectations. With iMaster NC Fabric, you can not only build simulation instances based on production instances to isolate simulation data from production data, but also view the impact of network changes. Next, let's look at how to deploy network change simulation on the GUI by using link reliability verification on Bangzi's data center network as an example. Bangzi's data center uses the dual spying deployment mode. Assume that the optical modules used to connect server leave one and spine one encounter an alarm, and the network administrator needs to replace the optical modules. Before replacing optical modules. The administrator needs to check whether disconnecting a link between server leaf one and spine one will affect services. First, click the smart assistant icon. Click network change detection in the service intent area. Select the fabric for which network change simulation is to be performed, and click immediate simulation to start the simulation task. On the link derivation tab page, find the desired device and link. Change the status of one link between server leaf one and spine one to not passed, and click save. In this way, we complete the intent input. Next, we perform underlay network simulation and verification. Click underlay simulation. iMaster NC Fabric analyzes the impact of changes on the underlay network from multiple dimensions, such as network connectivity, root black hole. Address conflict and configuration consistency. Now let's continue with overlay service verification. Click overlay simulation and select the source and destination VMs to simulate the traffic path change between the two VMs. Click simulation verification. After the verification is complete, a network simulation and verification report is generated. Click view full path. We can see that the result is reachable after the link is disconnected. This means that disconnecting the link does not affect interspine service traffic. In this case, the network administrator can replace the optical module without affecting services. Set the status of the link with the optical module replaced to pass, and the link of other optical module to not passed. And click Save to perform underlay network simulation and verification. Next, perform overlay service verification. Click Overlay Simulation. 
Select the source and destination VMs and click Simulation Verification. After the simulation and verification is completed, click View Full Path to view the simulation result, which is reachable. In this case, the network administrator can replace the optical module without affecting services. With the network change simulation function of iMaster NC Fabric, Bank Z is able to verify that service traffic will be properly switched to the standby link during the replacement of the optical module on the active link. The verification does not have any impact on the network and covers both the underlay and overlay networks. This ensures the correctness of the network change solution. Well, that's all for this episode of Test It, Believe It. Thank you.